this is ridiculous. It's only breakfast time and my morning is already ruined. Now I'm meant to find my oyster fork in here, let alone a knife to butter my toast with in this disorganised mess. This definitely needs an insert and I'm going to show you how easy it is to make a custom one. But first, I'm going to, to butter my toast. <sighs> Can't believe it. Unbelievable. I'm not even hungry anymore. <sighs> For this cutlery insert, we're throwing away the plastic and we're bringing in some Maranti. Now, this is 66 by 12. You can get it off the shelf from the hardware store. It is a hardwood, but it's a soft hardwood, so it's a lot easier to work with. The first thing I want to do is start cutting everything to size. Seven, With everything cut, we're ready to put this tray together. I'm starting with the outside perimeter. The shape is going to be a rectangle. And to put it together, I've just got some little 25mm bullet head nails and I'll be using PVA glue. You just want to make sure that you do pre-drill your hole before you put your nail in, because it makes it a lot easier and you won't split the timber. Yeah. With the outside perimeter intact, I can now work on the centre. The trick here is, before I put this centre rail in, you want to make sure that you get your little dividers on each side. Then when they're attached, it will just slip in and we can finish fixing it off on the outside. Once you've marked out your centre rail, before you do fix it off, you just want to sit it inside your frame and mark both perimeters. That way, when we do sit it in place, it's a matter of just pulling the dividers to the marks and fixing it off. And with everything together, I can now slip the main frame over and fix it in place. I'm just using some clamps to hold it together while I nail it, just so it doesn't bounce around everywhere. I think it'll make it easier. We'll soon find out. frame together, I'm just going over it and giving it a light sand just to get rid of those sharp edges and then I'll be finishing it off with some food safe oil. And how good does that look? The only thing that will look better than this is an organised drawer. I wish Mum used this one on me when I was a little boy. Wouldn't have felt a thing. <laughs> well, that fits like a glove. And all the time and stress this will take out of your life makes this project a must. And the best thing is, now I'm always going to know where my tiny whisk is.